Hi everyone, I wanted to show you how to get started with tapping. So I'll go through each of the points with you and also explain how you can get started and it'd be easy for you to, to get going with tapping. So we start off with the karate chop and that is the side of the hand here and we, it's just the spongy part that we just tap and this is where we do the setup statement. So I'll do an example and I'll go through a whole round with you. So we would say that even though I feel overwhelmed I deeply and completely love and accept myself so this is where we would do it three times and then we um, do the next point which is where the eyebrow point um, the hairline finishes and we tap on there and then side of the eye under the eye under the nose in the crease of the chin and then on the spongy part of the collarbone we tap on here four inches under the arm, so like where the bra strap is, and then top of the head. So the pressure for all of these points, I want it to be just nice and not too hard because you end up being black and blue, but just enough that um, a nice amount of pressure. And so we work through all of that and then you do through, um, you you do that many times and at different points. So we always start off with a scale of seeing where you are one to ten. So, for example, of what I was doing about overwhelmment, um, we would ask how intense is it is. So ten being really tense, and one being like you're calm and cause a cucumber. So you scale yourself where you are on there. And then afterwards you'll see how far it's gone down. So if I just go through a round with you, and you can do it for overwhelm if, if it's something that, or maybe something else that you may want to go through. Um, but and there is like a thing of borrowing benefits so that even though you do a tap and round, it's not necessarily on the point that you're, or the subject that you are um, wanting to, to, to go through, actually you can get benefits from it, which is a brilliant thing. So, if I just do it with overwhelmment to get give you an idea and uh, and show you other ways that you can do it as well. So the side of the hand. So even though I feel overwhelmed, I deeply and completely love and accept myself. Even though I feel overwhelmed. I deeply and completely love and accept myself. Even though I feel overwhelmed, I deeply and completely love and accept myself. Okay, so side of the, um, the eyebrow point, this overwhelming feeling that I get when I'm doing my work I just get so overwhelmed and it stresses me out and I just get overwhelmed whenever I try to do my work but I just get overwhelmed with different ideas and not knowing how to get started or feel that things have been complete and this stresses me out and I freeze and don't do anything so I'm choosing now to release these feelings of overwhelmment I choose to release it from my mind, my body and my spirit and take a deep breath in and out. So I just did three rounds there so that just gives you an idea and then you'll see where you are with the scale one to ten and then you do another round. Also you ask yourself what comes up so if anything came up from that um, and you can go into detail with that.
So the three ideas of being able to get yourself going with tapping so that you can do it for yourself is that you can um, write it down in a journal so you just literally writing down your thoughts and then afterwards you tap in on on those thoughts that have come up from your journal a second one is that you can just use the same word so sometimes this is a great one when you can get a bit bogged down thinking what do i say and i love this because i just concentrate on the one word and i just tap on that so for example with the overwhelming feelings this overwhelming feeling this overwhelming feeling, I'm feeling overwhelmed, 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 and then take a deep breath in and out. So it's you can keep it to strip it back so that you're not having to complicate it and think, oh, what do I say next? And that works in itself. And then you can use another word. And another one is uh, you can do it like a story. So you're maybe in an event of something that's happened that's maybe uh, has stressed you out or made you feel overwhelmed and you're going through that story. So that time that I felt overwhelmed, it really made me feel overwhelmed. It really stressed me out. I didn't like it. But I had so much to do. I didn't like it. And I couldn't do anything. And so you'd do it i sometimes did this with my partner I'll, I'll be going into the story a bit and i'll be just tapping along as, as if it was a conversation and just telling him what's happened and then just tapping as i go along and then that helps and that's just releasing that charge from that memory from whatever that stressed you out at that time so i hope that served you that's really helped you just get started um with tapping um i will be doing other videos so that you get other ideas of how to um, talk about different areas but it's really a great tool to be able to help you just to get out of your way whatever's holding you back and just heal and shed light on what it is that you feel that is just needing to um, move forward in your life so i hope you have a lovely day and uh, keep on tapping bye